So, where would you like to work? So, I'm going to I'm going to go to the house. 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 Pale? Yes. Hapa tu? Yes. Na hiyo ni rent. Yes. Lakini sasa hapa we huko na bahati kwa sababu ya hii program ya, ya affordable housing ya serikali. Yes. Sasa ulipi 35. Yes. Sasa kakua unalipa karibu eh, 16,000 hapo. Kwe, lakini rather ni nyumba ikuwe ya. Yes. Na Sindio? Na kushukuru sana. Sindio? Yes. Na unajua vile tumepikisha maneno hapo? Yes. Ni mamba ungapi? Tatu. Mamba wani? Sisi kama serikali tumetoa shamba. Yes. So hile garama ya shamba yes. imeondoka. Yes. Ya pili, hile pesa unajua kwa hii eh, housing levy. Sasa tunatumia hiyo housing levy, badala ya wewe kulipa mortgage 20%, yes. sasa utakua unalipa 6%. Yes. Ndiyo unaona hiyo bei imekuja? Mokuja chini. Yes. So wewe zika tanana. Zika tanana na mungo mungo tansaidia. Yes. Very good. Okay. Sahi mahali kwa unalipa rent pesa ngapi? At least mimi ni hasola. Naishi ya kama ya 10,000 lakini naishi huko pangani. Mbali. Yeah, mbali na kazi. Sasa hapa utalipa 15,000 kwa kazi na ni nyumba yako. Yes. Very good. Sasa utumie sasa utumie transport. Na ni nyumba hiyo ya tumia transport na shukuru. Okay, mudoni. Mimi mwenyewe leo nimeingia kwa nyumba moja ya civil servant askari polisi na famili yake nimeenda pale nikakuta ako na very beautiful three bedroom na watoto wake watoto wake wako pale na sasa badala ya vile angekuwa analipa mortgage ya 77000 sasa atakuwa analipa about 22000 sasa si hiyo ni maendeleo mimi naweza taka kuuliza wa Kenya if you don't want this kind of a project what else should we be doing kama siyo kazi kama hii? Si imesaidia hii area. It has grown the area. Tangu sasa hizi uh, project zianze. Vijana wetu wamepata kazi. And I can tell you your excellency. Wakati tulikuwa tunazunguka. Tukitafuta kazi ama kura. Kila mahali tulienda. Wanainchi walisema vijana wetu hawana kazi, wanakaa nyumbani na sisi, tafadhali saidia wawe na kazi. Na sasa tumepata ajira, mweshimi wagekari ya want to confirm to you. Tumeongea na president, tukaongea na waziri murkomen, ile shamba kubwa pale ya Kenya Airport Authority. Hapo pia mweshimi wa rais, ametupatia 100 acres. Ili tuweze kujenga almost a whole city hapo. Na manyumba mingi sana, so that we can change the face of Nakuru, in addition to factories and industries in that area. Juu ya hizi makoti. Sometimes imekua too much. Kila president akijaribu kuendelea maendeleo, mutu anakimbia kotini, anapewa order, maendeleo inasimamishu wa nakoti. Kweli hii ni ungua na kweli? Hata kidogo sio vizuri. Kwa hivyo mimi nataka kuambia your excellency. Endelea hapo hapo, kanyangia hapo hapo. Let nobody delay your development agenda hapa naivasha ndio mahali tutafanya green industrialization this is where we are going to have 100% green energy for our africa green industrialization agenda nilikuwa kule dubai mwisho wa mwaka uliopita na muliona kampuni nyingi waliweka MOU na serikali ya Kenya ya green industrialization itakayofanya itakayofanyika Kenya na mahali itaanza ni hapa Naivasha kwa sababu hapa ndio tuko na umeme ya mvuke ama e, geothermal power ambayo itakuja hapa na vile vile kama serikali tumegazet Ya kwamba hapa stima itapatikana kwa bei ya chini zaidi karibu duniani hapa.
hapa ndio utalipa shilingi tano. Five shillings pa kilowatt hour. So this is the place where we will have the most affordable energy anywhere in the Republic of Kenya, especially in all our special economic zones. We have agreed, and the Minister for Trade and Industrialization is here, that on top of what we are doing here in Ivasha, because we believe in the industrialization of Kenya, and because we want to drive our industrialization agenda, and especially industrialization as a percentage of our GDP, which has not been doing well for the last 15 years, it is time to revise the trajectory of growth in our industrialization space. And it is the reason why we are specifically targeting our special economic zones, including this one, with incentives for manufacturing, for industrialization, and making sure that we work with companies that will not only enhance our FDI, foreign direct investment, but it will also give us the opportunity to grow our industrialization and exports. Mm -hmm.